Welcome to Nassau Taxi Connect, powered by Ricky Love Bahamas Taxi and Tour. All right, so to get started, we're going to go to the App Store or the iPhone Store, and we're going to go and look for an app called Taxi Booker. Once we have that app, we're going to install it. Now, depending on the speed of your phone or whether or not you're around Wi-Fi connection, the installation process might take two to three minutes, okay? So right now, the app is being installed. And once the installation process is completed, we will open up the app and move forward, okay? Now, the app itself, once open, asks you for your company that you would be working with. And this is where the collaboration between Nassau Taxi Connect and Ricky Love Taxi and Tours come into play. So your company that you'll be searching for is Ricky Love Taxi. Now once the installation is done and we open up, we'll walk you through that step. Okay, just a few more minutes for the installation. And we'll be moving right forward, okay? And like I said, depending on your internet speed, um, your mobile data rates, and even your company, your mobile company, the installation process could take two to three minutes. So just be a little bit patient and it'll open up and we move forward with the video. Okay, there we are, opened up. So let's open it up. It's the Taxi Booker app. Now you'll notice once you come in, it's going to ask you for... What is your taxi company name? This is where you're going to put in the Ricky Love Taxi. And here we go. Once you start typing it, it pulls up. Select that. Now we're going to add this to our home screen. So from this forward, point forward, every time you need to book, you'll click on the icon there and be able to get into your booking app. Now, here they ask you to create an account. Uh, which is a short process. I have a count already, so let's just sign in. And then we're going to put in our uh, password, okay? And sign in. There we go, guys. We're logged in. Now Google is going to ask us to use the app location. So we're going to be turning that on. And it's hit while using the app. We're going to hit that. And now it's connected to the Google Maps. Now, as you can see, your pickup location, uh, in most cases, the app will automatically show you your pickup location. But if it doesn't, we'll install one. Let's do that now. Now we're here in the Bahamas. So let's just say Atlantis. It's one of our major resorts. So let's say we want to be picked up at Atlantis, right? We put that in there. And we're going to set that as our pickup location. Uh, our drop-off location or our destination location, we're going to put that in. And we're going to go to one of our other resorts called the Bahamar. So once we see the Bahamar, we'll select that as our destination. So let's set our drop-off or destination. And as you can see right away, the app finds you a vehicle and gives you a quote for one person. Uh, the vehicle is saying it's eight minutes away from my address. I can also choose to increase the number of passengers by sliding the slide bar. So let's just slide it and say four passengers. Now, as you can see, the quote has changed and it is for four passengers. Okay, now depending on the vehicle that you want, and you can click right here on the vehicle that you see that's giving you the quote, and it opens up that you can see other vehicles that might be available. Also, with the amount of time 
before they reach you, okay? But we're going to just stick with the luxury class because that's closer. Hit done, go back. And at this point, you can now book your ride and your driver will be heading towards you. Now, once you book your ride, you'll be able to see the driver coming. You'll see which taxi number and also a picture of your driver. Okay, thank you very much for watching the instructional video. I hope this helps you to become more proficient with our app. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.